Warning. This video contains slight use of strong language. Enjoy. Oh look, a royal guard. They say they don't react to anything. Well, let's see if we can fix that, shall we? Boo! Well, that didn't work. Let's try something else. Fuck it right in the pussy! Still nothing. Looks like we'll have to go further. Ah 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 Get back from the Queen's Court! Well 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 would you look at that? He finally reacted. Getting a royal guard to react is a masterful achievement. All I needed to do was shout in his ear. What part of get back from the Queen's Court don't you understand? Actually, I have a better idea. How about you face my teeth? Face it, face it, face it, face it, face it. We a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a. This is your last chance. If you don't get back, there will be trouble. Ow 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 ow! That hurts so bad. You're going to get into big trouble for this lizard. Shut up. No one's going to help you, you prick. Now, if you excuse me, I have a McDonald's to attend to. You're right, Sabrina. Flying is fun. Told you so. I knew you would get used to it eventually. This kind of reminds me of Transformers Revenge of the Fallen in the scene where Jetfire merged with Optimus Prime and kicked some Decepticon butt. Oh yeah. I remember that film. Despite all the hate it got, I actually kind of liked it. Maybe we should watch it when we get home. Um. As much as I hate to interrupt your conversation, you might want to look down there. What is it, Salem? Oh my god. Do my eyes deceive me? Something tells me your vision is correct. That royal guard looks like he is hurt. I say we should go and help him right away. Good idea, Callum. Are you okay, sir? Do you need any help? I was doing my guard duty. When all of a sudden a Spider-Man villain, the evil alter ego of Dr. Connors came over and started saying things to me in order to try and get me to react when I am not supposed to. He tried to scare me by yelling boo, said F her right in the P word and yelled in my ear. I ordered him to get back but he ignored me and bragged about getting me to react. I told him again but he still ignored me and proceeded to pretend to be Boris the Teeth Guy. After warning him once more, he kicked me in the shin. Ouch. That must have hurt. Do you need us to call an ambulance? I appreciate your concern, but I think I will be fine. Now go and catch that troublemaker who did this to me, so he can receive consequences. Wait, did you say it was the evil persona of Dr. Connors? Yes. I think I know who you are talking about. It's Lizard from The Amazing Spider-Man if I am not mistaken. That's right, Salem. Do you know which way he went? He went that way. I think he said something about going to McDonald's. Thank you for telling us this. We'll go and catch this troublemaker so that he can be punished severely. Come on, Callum. We have no time to lose. Let's go and catch this reptile. Right away, Sabrina. Let's roll. Wow. Whoever knew that there was a McDonald's so close to Buckingham Palace? It's a wonder why the Queen doesn't come here. I sure am looking forward to chowing down on a delicious double cheeseburger while drinking a refreshing milkshake. Stay where you are, lizard. What the? Oh no. It's the cult of the White Dragon. They must have found out about what I've done. Screw the McDonald's. I've got to get out of here. Stop right there, criminal scum. Stop right now, lizard. You mean it. No. You'll never take me alive. Alright then. I didn't think it would come to this, but I have no alternative. What I am going to have to do is turn off my jetpack and jump on him. 
Are you sure you want to do that? It sounds pretty dangerous. Well, what choice do I have? If I don't do it, Lizard might get away. If you fail, you might get badly injured. Well Salem, it's a risk I'm going to have to take. Alright, just don't go splat on the pavement. Okay Callum, it's now or never, good luck. Okay, here goes. Don't sold this captain. It's not fire. Wah. You have no idea how much trouble you are in right now, lizard. You seriously had the nerve to bully and then attack a royal guard. What you did is a very serious felony, and you are going to stay right where you are until the police arrive. Also, we will be phoning Dr. Connors to tell him about what you did, and I am pretty sure that he won't be happy with you. Lizard, I am arresting you on suspicion of harassment and assault on a royal guard. You do not need to say anything, but it may harm your defense if you do not mention, when questioned something which you later rely on in court. Anything you do say may be given in evidence. Do you understand that? Yes, officer. Good. Now get in the car, so that we can get to the slammer. Wow, Callum. That was amazing, especially the way you pin Lizard to the ground. At first I did not think I would succeed, but it turns out I did. And I think it's safe to say that Lizard won't be able to have his McDonald's. And why is that? Because the only meal he'll be allowed to eat is lumpy potatoes. <laughs> Oh 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 Lizard, are you having a joke with me right now? I can't believe you bullied then attacked a royal guard. You know that royal guards are there to protect the queen and you went so far as to physically assault one. Now I have to pay a huge fine which costs more than my lab. Not to mention that not only did you get yourself into trouble, but you got myself and all of Oscorp into trouble as well. The company's reputation now lies in tatters thanks to you. I wish I had never injected myself with that serum to become you in the first place, that's it. You are grounded until Andrew Garfield stars in The Amazing Spider-Man 3. And while you are grounded, you will be eating nothing but lumpy potatoes for every meal. Now go and sleep on your prison bed, you disgusting alter ego of mine. Wow. And if you don't stop crying like a motor car, I swear to God I will turn you into one, and give you always a prize on one of Vance's game shows. Do you know what really grinds my gears? This is an ongoing issue in real life. People treat royal guards like trash when they are there risking their life to protect the queen and her jewels. On one occasion, one troublemaker thought it would be a good idea to throw a glove at a royal guard at the Tower of London and naturally, he got in trouble with a beefeater. He was very lucky he didn't get arrested even though he should have. On another occasion, a man dressed up as a royal guard and his friend did a prank on everyone thinking that he punched a royal guard when in reality, he hadn't. That really made a mockery out of the royal guards who work hard to protect the queen. So in short, this video was meant to send a message. Please don't treat the royal guards badly. Because if you do, it is very disrespectful to the royal guards and the queen herself. So if you visit Buckingham Palace, the Tower of London or Windsor Castle, please, treat the royal guards with respect. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, comment like and subscribe, and I'll see you all next time. This is Callum Rockley signing off.